one of the largest cities in the state of Uttar Pradesh, Meerut is a bustling metropolis with a diverse population and thriving economy, making it a popular destination for business, education and tourism. However, it witnesses extreme climatic conditions and is prone to earthquakes and droughts. Being set in such a context calls for a sustainable approach in terms of architecture. The shortage of resources creates a need for energy conservation as well. Our brief includes designing a multi-family staff housing complex for Major Dhyanshan Sports University. The site lies adjacent to Freshwater Canal. With the amount of direct sunlight the site receives, it provides opportunity for harnessing solar energy. After trying out multiple iterations via shadow analysis, the orientation of the housing towers was optimized to minimize radiation while maximizing daylight. All the housing units are south-facing and have curved solar chimneys to allow maximum efficiency. Solar panels have been provided on the roofs of the housing towers and solar sheds on surface parking spaces. This way, as per our calculations, we should be able to generate more energy than we consume, making our design net positive in terms of energy usage. For efficient and easy waste management, we have provided garbage chutes on every floor level that can be used by all three housing units. A material recovery facility has also been put up on the site in order to recycle waste products which add to our goal of achieving sustainability. A water-cooled BRF system is provided for HVAC, which leads to energy savings of 30%. Cork cladding has been used for the external wall, which has the negative global warming potential. This led to 86% reduction of carbon emissions from base case. Unlike conventional construction practices which follow a linear construction timeline, we devised a schedule where multiple phases of construction take place simultaneously. This ensures early completion and returns from the project. Open areas and breakout spaces are also an integral part of our design to improve connection to outdoor spaces. Special attention has been given to the species of plants for zeriscaping. This also contributes to further reduction in water consumption on the site. With the combination of all these design elements, our building becomes self-sufficient and net zero in terms of energy, water, waste and carbon emissions. <laughs>